In today's tutorial, I wanna share with you our process for creating a Canva template for IGTV videos. Now, every week inside of our Instagram feed, we're releasing a new IGTV video and it kind of looks like this. And when it's put onto our Instagram feed, it looks like this. So we get lots of questions of how we do that and that's what today's tutorial is all about. For the best advice and tips on growing your audience with fresh content ideas, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll get my latest uploads every week. Before we get started, I do want to mention that there are two components to an IGTV design. Number one, there's the cover image or the thumbnail. This is what is shown on your feed. The second component is the actual IGTV video itself and that design. Both the cover image and the IGTV are the same size. So what you need is an IGTV or an Instagram story size template. So what you do inside of Canva is go to the Canva search bar and type in Instagram story and bring up any Instagram story templates that you may or may not want to start with. So like I mentioned, your IGTV cover image can be different than your actual IGTV design. However, in my business, the cover image that's seen on the feed is very much similar to the actual IGTV video itself. So in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create an IGTV template, and you can just know that you can create a different cover if you would like. So the thing to consider is that you probably will want your IGTV template to be center weighted, meaning the design is in the center of the video. For now, what I've done is I've opened up a blank template and I'm going to use one of these as my background because I like the pattern and I'll just replace the image with the video and the text. So I'm gonna add and apply this template and I'm gonna delete this photo and I'm gonna rotate this because I will use that as the background of my video. Now the one thing I want to keep in mind is that the center of this design will be showing on my Instagram feed. So we wanna make sure that we get the visual and the text within the center of this image. So we're gonna go to elements and we're gonna add a box outline just to help guide us in the design process. So we're gonna move this and make sure that it's centered with the design and the canvas. There's the center. So I wanna keep my video and my text within that yellow box. So I'm actually gonna make this a darker color and I'm gonna send it to the back and we'll delete it when we're all done. So, knowing that this is the placement and we wanna keep everything within the black box, I'm gonna move this down and I'm gonna place my YouTube video on top of this blue, blue rectangle. So you can go and upload your videos under uploads. You go to videos and you can upload uh, the video that you wanna put on your IGTV. And so this is the video I'm gonna use. It's 56 seconds. All right, so I've added the video on top of that blue rectangle. Now I'm ready to add text to this design. So I will go to the text and I will add my normal heading text and I will move it to the top of this square area and I will start to insert the topic of my IGTV video. All right, I've added some text here and now I feel that I am ready to remove that black box. So for now, what I'm going to do is move this white checkerboard thing to the back behind it and then grab the black border and delete it. 
Now that I have the text in place and the video in place, I'm ready to kind of update the brand colors because these certainly aren't my colors. So I will go through and update these things for my brand. Okay, so I, I really like this. I am struggling a little bit with this checkerboard. It doesn't quite feel right, so I'm gonna make it very faint. I like it, but maybe not that much. The other thing is, is I feel like this is the wrong color, so I will change it to something a little more fun, and then I will move some of these things up out of the way of the text, and play around with that. So there I have a template I'm ready to download. It looks like this grid down here didn't quite change like the other one, so I will change that so that they're the same. All right, so now I'm ready to actually put this on my Instagram. The only thing that's missing is the captions underneath the video. So as you can see on my IGTV, when you hit play, it captions what I am saying. And there's a couple of ways that you can achieve that. Number one, you can use an app called AutoCap. It's a mobile app that's completely free and you upload your video into their app and it will automatically caption and add a caption onto your video. AutoCap is available on Google Play Store and Apple phones, and so it's simply just uploading the video and it will add the text of your caption on top of the video. But you actually don't have to do that because Instagram will automatically caption your video for you in 16 plus different languages. You just have to make sure that your account settings are set up. To set up your account, properly for IGTV captions to be automatically generated, you're gonna go to your Instagram account and click on settings. Then when you click on settings, it'll open up here and you will go to your account. Once you go to your account, you will come over to captions and make sure that captions are turned on. But you're not quite ready yet. Next, you need to turn them on for your IGTV video when you upload it. When you upload a new IGTV video, you come down to the bottom under advanced settings just before you hit publish, and it will open up into these advanced settings and under accessibility, you turn on auto-generated captions for that IGTV video. So when you're done with your Canva template, you will want to download this as a video. So you'll go to download and download as an MP4 video. I'm gonna download that now and I'm actually gonna show you why we use the app AutoCap because we actually don't publish our IGTV videos straight from the mobile app. We scheduled the IGTV videos ahead of time using Creator Studio. And Creator Studio doesn't have the caption advanced settings when you are uploading a new IGTV. So we add the captions before hitting publish. So here I am on Creator Studio. This is a free scheduling tool provided by Facebook for my Facebook page and my Instagram. And so I'll go to Create Post, IGTV, and I will upload the video that I created. So here the video is created and you can see the lovely look on my face it might be better if I created a different cover image, which is why cover images are great for your IGTV. So you can actually come over here to cover image and pick something different from the video. So there's lots of, of um, screenshots that I can choose from and then go back to the post info, add a title for the IGTV and description and hashtags if you want and either publish now or schedule for later or save as a draft. 
So there you have it. That is how you can create an IGTV video inside of Canva and make it look super on brand. So now that you know more, what about the next step? I've put together hundreds of made for you stock photos and done for you Canva templates with 30 content ideas. So you can get started creating content right away. You can grab it right below this video. It's absolutely free. Also, if you're finding it hard to get new subscribers or connect with your audience, I've got a Secret Society Facebook group where you can join others and connect with other content creators and you can get a link to that right below this video as well.